the movie script according to all known laws of aviation. There is no way a bee should be held to fly. Its wings are too small to get its fat little body off the ground. The bee, of course, flies anyway because bees don't care what humans think is impossible. Yellow, black, yellow, black, yellow, black, yellow, black, too. Black and yellow. Let's shake it up a little. Berry, breakfast is ready. Zooming, hang on a second. Hello, Berry, Adam, only you believe this is happening. I can't. I'll pick you up. Looking sharp. Use the stairs. Your father paid the good money for those. Sorry, I'm excited. Here's the graduate. We're very proud of you. Son, a perfect report card. All BS. Very proud. I got a thing going here. You got Lynn on your fuzz. That's me. Wave to us. We'll be in. Rowan Heen 18. Bye, Barry. I told you. Stop flying in the house. Hey. Adam. Hey. Barry, is that fuzz gel? A little special day. Graduation. Never thought I'd make it. Three days grade school. Three days high school. Those were awkward. Three days college. I'm glad that I took a day and hitchhiked around the hive. You did come back different. Hi, Barry. Artie. Growing a mustache. Looks good. Hear about Frankie? Yeah. You going? To the funeral? No. I'm not going. Everybody knows. Sting someone. You die. Don't waste. It on a squirrel. Such a huff head. I guess he could have just gotten out of the way. I love. Just incorporating an amusement park in our day. That's why we don't need vacations. Boy. Quite a bit of pump. Under the circumstances. Well. Adam. Today we are men. We. Are. Be men. Amen. Hallelujah. Students. Faculty. Distinguished bees. Please welcome. Dean Boswell. Welcome. New High Voidly graduating class of. Nine. Fifteen point that concludes our. Ceremonies. And begins your career at Honex Industries. Will we pick our group today? I heard. It's just orientation. Heads up. Here we go. Keep your hands and antennas inside the tram. At all times. Wonder what it will be like. A little scary. Welcome to Honex. A division. Of Honexco and a part of the Hexagon Group. This is it. Wow. Wow. We know that you. As a. B. Have worked your whole life to get to the point where you can work for your whole. Life. Honey. Begins when our valiant pollen jocks bring the nectar to the hive. Our. Top secret formula is automatically color corrected. Then adjusted and bubble contoured. Into the soothing sweet syrup with its distinctive golden glow you know as. Honey. The girl was hot. She's my cousin. She is. Yes. We're all cousins. Right. You're right. At Hall next. We constantly strive to improve every aspect of bee existence. These bees are stress testing a new helmet technology. What do you think he makes? Not enough. Here we have our latest advancement. The Krellman. What does that do? Which is their little strand of money that hangs in after you pour it. Saves us millions. When anyone work on the Krellman. Of course. Most bee jobs are small ones. But bees know that every small job, if it's done well, means a lot. But choose carefully because you'll stay in the job you pick for the rest of your life. The same job the rest of your life. I didn't know that. What's the difference? You'll be happy to know that bees, as a species, haven't had one day off in 27 million years. So you'll just work us to death. You'll sure try. Wow. That blew my mind. What's the difference? How can you set one job forever? That's an insane choice to have to make. I'm relieved, now we only have to make one decision in life, but Adam, how could they never have told us that? Why would you question anything? We're bees, we're the most perfectly functioning society on earth. You ever think maybe things work a little too well here? Like what? Give me one example. I don't know, but you know what I'm talking about. Please clear the gate. Royal nectar, for sun approach, wait a second, or heck it out. Those are pollen jocks. Wow, I've never seen them this close. They know what it's like outside the hive. Yeah, but some don't come back. Hi. Jocks. Hi. Jocks. You guys did great. You're monsters. You're sky freaks. I love it. I love it. I wonder where they were. I don't know. Their day's not planned. Outside the hive. Flying who knows where. Doing who knows what. You can't just decide to be a pollen. Jock, you have to be bred for that. Right. Look, that's more pollen than you I will see in a lifetime. It's just a statist symbol. Bees make too much of it. Perhaps, unless, you're wearing it and the ladies see you wearing it. Those ladies, aren't they our cousins? Too distant, distant. Look at these two. People of hot Harry's. Let's have fun with them. It must be dangerous being a pollen jock. Yeah, once a bear pinned me against a mushroom. He had a pour on my throat. And with the other, he was slapping me. Oh, my, I never thought I'd knock him out. What were you doing during this? Trying to alert the authorities. I can autograph that, a little gusty out there today, wasn't it? Comrades, 
Yeah, Gusty. We're hitting a sunflower patch six miles from her and here tomorrow. Six miles? Huh, Barry. A puddle jump for us. But maybe you're not up for it. Maybe I am. Yeah. Or not. We're going 0019 to June Gate. What do you think? Buzzy boy. Are you big enough? I might be. It all depends on what 0019 means. Hey. Oh, next. Dad? You surprise me. You decide what you're interested in. Well, there's a lot of choices. But you get one. Do you ever get bored doing the same job every day? Son, let me tell you about straight. Yeah. Grab that stick. And you just move it around. And when you stir it around, you get yourself into a rhythm. It's a beautiful thing. You know, Dad, the more I think about it, maybe the honey feel just isn't right for me. You are thinking of what? Making balloon animals. That's a bad job for girls with a stinger. Janet, you're the son's not sure he wants to go new. Honey, Barry, you are so funny sometimes. I'm not trying to be funny. You're not funny. You're going into honey, our son. The stirrer, you're gonna be a stirrer. No, one's listening to me. Wait till you see the sticks I have. I could say anything right. Now, I'm gonna get in and tattoo. Let's open some honey and celebrate. Maybe I'll pierce my thorax, shave my aunt Annie, shack up with a grasshopper, get a gold to thin call. Everybody dog, I'm so proud. We're starting work today. Today's the day. Come on. All the good jobs will be gone. Yet. Yeah. Right. Pollen counting. Stunt B. Pouring. Stirrer. From desk. Hair removal. Is it still available? Hang on. To left. One of them's. Yours. Congratulations. Step to the side. What did you get? Kicking crud out. Stellar. Wow. Super of newbies. Yes. Sir. Our first day. We are ready. Make your choice. Yeah. Will you go first? No. You go. Um, my. What's available? Restroom attendance open. Not. For the reason you think. Any chance of getting the Krellman? Sure. You're on. Fine. Sorry. The Krellman just closed out. What's monkeys always open? The Krellman opened up again. What happened? A bee died. Makes an opening. See. He's dead. Another dead. One. Daddy. Deadified. Two more dead. Dead from the neck up. Dead from the neck down. It's life. Oh. This is so hard. Heating. Cool. Stunt B. Horror. Stir. Humming. Inspector number. Seven. Lip. Coordinator. Stripe supervisor. My wrangler. Barry. What do you think I should? Barry. Barry. All right. We've got the sunflower patch in quadrant nine. What? Happened to you? Where are you? I'm going out. Out. Out getting air. Out there. Oh. No. I have two. Before I go to work for the rest of my life. You're gonna die? You're crazy. Hello. Another call coming in. If anyone's feeling brave. There's a Corindale on 83rd. That gets their roses today. Hey. Guys. Look at that. Isn't that the kid we saw? Yesterday. Hold it. Son. Fly decks. Restricted. It's okay. Lou. We're gonna take him up. Really? Feeling lucky. Are you? Sign here. Here. Just initial at. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Got a rain advisory today. And as you know. Bees cannot fly in rain. So be careful. As always. Wash your brooms. Hockey sticks. Dog. Birds. Bears and bats. Also. I got a. Couple of reports of root there being poured on us. Murphy's in a home book of it. Babbling like a cicada. That's awful. And it reminded for your keys. Be law number. One. Absolutely no talking to humans. Alright. Launch positions. Buzz. 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 Black and yellow. Hello. Eerie four. This. Heart shot. Yeah. Yeah. Bring it on. Wind. Checked. And aiming. Checked. Nectar pack. Checked. Wings. Checked. Stinger. Checked. Scared out of my shorts. Checked. Okay. Ladies. Let's move it out. Pound those petunias. You striped stem suckers. All of you. And drain those. Flowers. Wow. I'm out. I can't believe I'm out. So blue. I feel so fast and free. Bucks. Kite. Wow. Flowers. This is blue leader. We have roses visual. Bring it around 30 degrees. And hold. Roses. 30 degrees. Roger, bringing it around, stand to the side. Kit, it's got a bit of a kick. That is what nectar collector, ever see pollination up close? No, sir. I pick up some pollen here, sprinkle it over here, maybe a dash over there, a pinch on that. One, see that? It's a little bit of magic. That's amazing. Why do we do that? That's pollen power, more pollen, more flowers, more nectar, more honey for us. Who? I'm picking up a lot of bright yellow, goldy daisies. Don't we need those? To be the visual. Wait. One of these flowers seems to be on the move. Sigh again. You're reporting a moving flower. Affirmative. That was on the line. This is the coolest. What is it? I don't know. 
but I'm loving this color. It smells good, not like a flower, but I like it. Yet yeah. fuzzy, oh chemical why? Orful, guys, it's a little grabby. My sweet lord of bees, on day brain, get off there. Problem, guys, this could be bad. Affirmative, very close, gonna hurt. Mama's little boy, you are way out of position. Rookie, booming in a sea like a missile. Help me, I don't think these are flowers. Should we tell him? I think he knows. What? Is this? Match point, you can start packing up. Honey, because you're right about to eat it. Yowzer, gross, there's a bee in the car. Do something, I'm driving. Hi, bee, he's back there. He's going to sting me. Nobody move, if you don't move, he won't sting you. Freeze, he blinked. Spray him. Granny, what are you doing? Wow, the tension level out. There is unbelievable. I gotta get home. Won't fly in rain. Won't fly in rain. Won't fly in rain. Mayday, mayday. Be going down, Ken. Could you close the window, please, Ken? Could you close the window, please? Oh, heck out my new resume. I made it into a fold-out brochure. You see? Folds out. Oh, no. More humans. I don't need this. What was that? Maybe this. Time. This time. This time. This time. This time. This. Drapes. That is diabolical. It's fantastic. It's got all my special skills. Even my top 10 favorite movies. What's number? One. Star Wars. Nay. I don't go for that. Kind of stuff. No wonder we shouldn't talk to them. They were out of their minds. When I leave a job interview, they're flabbergasted. And believe what I say. There's the sun. Maybe that's a way out. I don't remember the sun having a big 75 on it. I predicted to global warming. I could feel it getting hotter. At first I thought it was just me. Wait. Stop. B. Stand back. These are winter boots. Wait. Don't kill him. You know I'm allergic to them. This thing could kill me. Why does his life have less value than yours? Why does his life have any less value than mine? Is that your statement? I'm just saying all life has value. You don't know what he's capable of. Feel my brochure. There you go. Little guy. I'm not scared of him. That's allergic. Think. Put that on your resume brochure. My whole face could puff up. Make it one of your special skills. Knocking someone out is also a special skill. Right. Bye. Vanessa. Thanks. Vanessa. Next week. Yogurt night. Sure. Can. You know. Whatever. You could put carob. Chips on there. Bye. Supposed to be less calories. Bye. I got to say something. She. Saved my life. I got to say something. All right. Here it goes. Nah. What would I say? Could really get in trouble. It's a B-law. You're not supposed to talk to a human. I can't believe I'm doing this. I've got two. I can't do it. Come on. No. Yes. No. Do it. I can't. How should I start it? You like jazz? No. It's no good. Here she comes. Speak. You fool. Hi. I'm sorry. You're talking. Yes. I know. You're talking. I'm so sorry. No. It's okay. It's fine. I know I'm dreaming. But I don't recall going to bed. Well. I'm sure this is very disconcerting. This is a bit of a surprise to me. I mean, you're a B. I am. And I'm not supposed to be doing this. But they were all trying to kill me. And if it wasn't for you, I had to thank you. It's just how I was raised. That was a little weird. I'm talking with a B. Yeah, I'm talking to a B. And the B is talking to me. I just want to say I'm grateful. I'll leave now. Wait, how did you learn to do that? What? The talking thing. Same way you did? I guess. Mama. Dada. Honey, you pick it up. That's very funny. Yeah, bees are funny. If we didn't laugh, we'd cry old election plate. Have to deal with. Anyway, when I get you something. Like what? I don't know. I mean, I don't know. Duffy, I don't want to put you out. It's no trouble. It takes two minutes. It's just coffee. I'd hate to impose. Don't be ridiculous. Actually, I would love cup. Hey, you want rum cake? I shouldn't have some. No, I can't. Come on. I'm trying to lose a couple micrograms. Where these stripes don't help. Yeah. Look great. I don't know if you know anything about fashion. Are you alright? No. He's making the tie in the cab as they're flying up Madison. He finally gets there. He runs up the steps into the church. The waiting is on. And he says, Watermelon. I thought you said, Watermelon. Why would I marry a watermelon? Is it a bee joke? That's the kind of stuff we do. Yeah. Different. So, what are you gonna do? Barry. About work. I don't know. I want to do my part for the hive. But I can't do it the way they want. I know how you feel. You do. Sure, my parents wanted me to be a lawyer or a doctor, but I wanted to be a florist. Really? My only interest is flowers. Our new queen was just elected with that same campaign slogan. Anyway, if you look, there's my hive right there. Say it. You're in sheep meadow. Yes. I'm right off the turtle pond. No way. 
I know that area. I lost a toe ring there once. Why do girls put rings on their toes? Why not? It's like putting a head on your knee. Maybe I'll try that. You all right, Mom? Oh, yeah, fine. Just having two cups of coffee. Anyway, this has been great. Thanks for the coffee. Yeah, it's no trouble. Sorry I couldn't finish it. If I did, I'd be up the rest of my life. Are you? Oh, night. take a piece of this with me. Sure, here. Have a crumb. Thanks. Yeah, all right. Well, then, I guess I'll see you around. Or not. Okay. Barry, and thank you so much again. For before. Oh, that, that was nothing. Well, not nothing. But, anyway, this can't possibly work. He's all set to go. We may as well try it. Okay. Dave, pull the chute. Sounds amazing. It was amazing. It was the scariest, happiest moment of my life. Humans. I can't believe you were with humans. Giant, scary humans. What were? They like huge and crazy. They talk crazy. They eat crazy giant things. They drive crazy. Do they try and kill you? Like on TV. Some of them, but some of them don't. How'd you get back, Poodle? You did it. And I'm glad you saw whatever you wanted to see. You had your experience. Now you can pick out your job and be normal. Well, 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 I met someone. You did. Was she beish? The wasp. Your parents woke you? No. 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 Not a wasp. Spider. I'm not attracted to spiders. I know it's the hottest thing. With the eight legs and all. I can't get by that face. So is she. She's human. No. No. That's a bee law. You wouldn't break a bee law. Her name's Vanessa. Oh. Boy. She's so nice. And she's a florist. Oh. No. You're nading a human florist. We're not nading. You're flying outside the hive. Talking to humans that attack our homes with power washers. And the mateys. One ape that a stick of dynamite. She saved my life. And she understands me. This is over. Eat this. This is not over. What was that? They call it a crumb. It was so sting stripey. And that's not what they eat. That's what falls off what they eat. Yeah. No one even is. No. It's bread and cinnamon and frosting. They heat it up. Sit down. Really hot. Listen to me. We are not them. We are us. Tears us in tears. Them. Yes. But who can deny the heart that is yearning? There's no yearning. Stop. Yearning. Listen to me. You have got to start thinking B. My friend. Thinking B. 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 There he is. He's in the pool. You know what your problem is? Barry. I got to start. Thinking B. How much longer will this go on? It's been three days. Aren't you? Working. I've got a lot of big life decisions to think about. It. What life? You have no life. You have no job. You're barely a bee. Would it kill you to make a little honey? Barry. Come out. Your father's talking to you. Martin. Would you talk to him? Barry. I'm talking to you. You coming. Got everything. All set. Go ahead. I'll catch up. Don't be too long. Watch this. Vanessa. We're still here. I told you not to yell at him. He doesn't respond to yelling. Then why yell at me? Because you don't listen. I'm not listening to this. Sorry. I've got to go. Where are you going? I'm meeting a friend. A girl. Is this why you can't decide? Bye. I just hope she's being sh They have a huge parade of flowers every year in Pasadena. To be in the Tournament of Roses. That's every florist's dream. Up on a float. Surrounded by flowers. Crowds cheering. A tournament. Do the roses. Compete in athletic events. No. All right. I've got one. How come you don't fly everywhere? It's exhausting. Why don't you run everywhere? It's faster. Yeah. Okay. I see. I see. All right. Your turn. TiVo. You can just freeze live TV. That's insane. You don't have that. We have TiVo. But it's a disease. It's a horrible, horrible disease. Oh, my dubbies. You must want to sting all those jerks. We try not to be able to sting. It's usually fatal for us. So you have to watch your temper. Buried carefully. You kick a wall. Take a walk. Write an angry letter and throw it out. Work through it like any emotion. Anger. Jealousy. Lust. Oh, my goodness. Are you okay? Yeah, what is wrong with you? It's a bug. He's not bothering anybody. Get out of here. You creep. What was that? Optic and save circular. Yeah, it was. How did you know? It felt like about 10 pages. 75 is pretty much our limit. You really got that down to a science. I lost a cousin to the alien vogue. I'll bet. What in the name of my T. Hercules is this? How did this get here? I'll be. Golden Blossom. Radio the private select. Is he the actor? I never heard of him. Why is this here? For people, we eat it. You haven't have enough food of your own. Well, yes. How do you get it? Bees make it. I know who makes it. And it's hard to make it. There's eating. Cooling. String. You need a whole Krellman thing. It's organic. It's organic. It's just honey. Berry. 
Just what? Bees don't know about this? This is stealing. A lot of stealing. We've taken our homes, schools, hospitals. This is all election plate. Have and some sale. I'm getting to the bottom of this. I'm getting to the bottom of all of this. Hi, Hector. You're almost done. Almost. He is here. I send sick. Well, I guess I'll go home now and just leave this nice honey out with no one around. You're busted. Box boy. I knew I heard something. See so him talk. I can talk. And now you'll start talking. Or you're getting the sweet stuff. Who's our supplier? I don't understand. I thought we were friends. The last thing we want to do is upset bees. You're too late. It's ours now. You, sir. Have crossed the wrong sword. You, sir. Will be a lunch for my iguana. Ignacio. Where is the honey coming from? Tell me where. Honey farms. It comes from? Honey farms. Or a Z person. What horrible thing has happened here? These faces. They never knew what hit them. And now they run the road to nowhere. Just keep still. What? You're not dead. Do I look dead? They will wipe anything that moves. When were you headed? To honey? Farms? I am onto something huge here. I'm gonna Alaska. Most blood. Crazy stuff. Blows your head off. I'm gonna to Tacoma. And yeah, he really is dead. Alright. Oh. What is that? Oh. No. A wiper. Triple blade. Triple blade. Jump on. It's your only chance. B. Why does everything have to be so dark and clean? How much do you people need to see? Open your eyes. Stick your head out the window. From Man PR News in Washington. Uh, or Le Castle. But don't kill no more bugs. B. Most blood guy. You hear something? Like what? Like tiny screaming. Turn off the radio. What's up? B boy. Hey. Blood. Just a row of honey jars. As far as the eye could see. Wow. I assume wherever this truck goes is where they're getting it. I mean, that honey's ours. Bees and height. We're all jammed. Him. It's a close community. Not us. Man. We're on our own. Every mosquito on his own. What? If you get in trouble, you a mosquito. You in trouble. Nobody likes us. They just smack. See a mosquito. Smack. Smack. At least you're out in the world. You must meet girls. Mosquito girls. Try to trade up. Get with them off. Dragonfly. Mosquito girl don't wanna know. Mosquito. You got to be kidding me. Moose blood's about to leave the building. So long. B. Hey. Guys. Moose blood. I knew I'd catch you all down there. Did you bring your crazy straw? We throw it in jars. Slap the label on it. And it's pr pretty much mere profit. What is? This place, a bee's got a brain the size of a pinhead. They are pinheads. Pinhead. Oh hecked. Out the new smoker. Oh, sweet. That's the one you want. The Thomas 3000. Smoker. 90. Puffs a minute. Semi-automatic. Twice to the nicotine. All the tar. A couple breaths of this. Knocks them right out. They make the honey. Though we make the money. They make the honey. Though we make the money. Oh my. What's going on? Are you okay? Yeah. It doesn't last too long. Do you know you're in a fake hive with fake walls? Our queen was moved here. We had no choice. This is a queen. That's a man in women's clothes. That's a drag queen. What is this? Oh, no. There's scenes of them. Be honey. Our honey is being brazenly stolen on a massive scale. This is worse than anything bears have done. I intend to do something. Oh, Barry. Stop. Who told you humans are taking our honey? That's a rumor. Do these look like rumors? That's a conspiracy theory. These are obviously doctored photos. How did you get mixed up in this? He's been talking to humans. What? Talking to humans. He has a human girlfriend. And they make out. Make out. Barry. We do not. You wish you could. Whose side are you on? The bees. I dated a cricket once. It's an Antonio. Those crazy eggs. Kept me up all night. Barry. This is what you want to do with your life. I want to do it. For all our lives. Nobody works harder than bees. Dad. I remember the you coming home so. Or worked your hands were still straight. You can stop. I remember the that. What right? Do they add to our honey? We live on to cups a year. They put it in lip balm for no reason whatsoever. Even if it's true. What can one be do? Sting them where it really hurts. In the face. The eye. That would hurt. No. Up the nose. That's the killer. There's only one place you can sting the humans. One place where it matters. Hive at five. The hive's only full. Our eye action news source. No more bee birds. With Bob Bumble at the anchor desk. Whether it was Storm Stinger. Sports with Buzz Larvy. Engine at Ong. Good evening. I'm Bob Bumble, and I'm Jeanette Ong, at the right counter B. Barry Benson, intends to sue the human race for stealing our honey, packaging it and profiting from it, illegally. Tomorrow night on B. Larry King, we have three former queens here, in our studio, discussing their new book, Alessi Ladies, out this week on Hexagon. Tonight we're talking to Barry Benson. Did you ever think, I'm a kid from the hive, I can't do this. Bees have never been afraid to change the world. What about B. Columbus, B. Gandhi? 
Bajasus, where I'm from. We never sue humans. We are thinking of stickball or candy. Stores, how old are you? The bee community is supporting you in this case. Which will be the trial of the bee century. You know, they have a Larry King in the human world too. It's a common name. Next week, it looks like you and is a Sean suspenders and colored dots. Next week, glasses. Quotes on the bottom from the guest even though you just heard him. Better week next week. They're scary. Harry and Eric always leans forward, pointy shoulders, squinty eyes, very Jewish. In tennis, you attack at the point of weakness. It was my grandmother, Ken. She's 81 point honey. Her backhand's a joke. I'm not gonna take advantage of that. Quiet, please. Actual work going on here. Is that that? Same B. Yes, it is. I'm helping of so the human race. Hello, hello, B. This is Ken. Yeah, I remember the you. Timberland. Size 10 and a half. Vibram soul. I believe. Why? Does he talk again? Listen. You better go cause we're really busy working. But it's our yogurt night. Bye bye. Why is yogurt night so difficult? You put a thing. You to have. Been at this for us. Yes. And that Adam here has been a huge help. Frosting. How many? Sugars. Just one. I try not to use the competition. So why are you helping me? Bees have good qualities. And it takes my mind off the shop. Instead of flowers. People are giving. Balloon and bouquets now. Those are great. If you're free. And artificial flowers. Those just give me psychotic. Yeah. Me too. Ben Stingers. Pointless pollination. Bees. Must hate those fake things. Nothing worse than a daffodil that's at work done. Maybe. This could make up for it a little bit. This lawsuit's a pretty big deal. I guess. Yeah. Sure you wanna go through with it. Eh. I sure. When I'm done with the humans. They won't. Be able to say. Honey. I'm home. Without paying a royalty. That's an incredible scene here. In downtown Manhattan. Where the world anxiously waits. Because for the first time in history, we'll hear for ourselves if a honey bee can actually speak. What have we gotten into here? Barry, it's pretty big, isn't it? I can't believe how many humans don't work during the day. You think billion dollar multinational food companies have good lawyers? Everybody needs to stay behind a barricade. What's the matter? I don't know. I just got a troll. Well, if it isn't the beating, you boys work on this. Arise. The honorable Judge Bumbleton presiding. All right. Was number 4,000 for Heen 75. Superior or New York. Barry B. Benson B. The honey industry is now in session, Mr. Montgomery. You're representing the five food companies collectively. A privilege, Mr. Benson. You're representing all the beasts of the world. I'm kidding. Yes. Your Honor. Well, we're ready to proceed, Mr. Montgomery. Your opening statement. Please, ladies and gentlemen of the jury. My grandmother was a simple woman, born on a farm. She believed it was man's divine right to benefit from the bounty of nature God put before us. If we lived in the topsy-turvy world Mr. Benson imagines, just think of what would it mean I would have to negotiate with the silkworm for the elastic in my britches. Talking bee, how do we know this isn't some sort of holographic motion picture capture of Hollywood wizardry? They could be using laser beams, robotics, ventral aquism, owning. For all we know, you could be on steroids, Mr. Benson, ladies and gentlemen. There's no trickery here. I'm just an ordinary bee. Honey's pretty important to me. It's important to all bees. We invented it. We make it. Though we protect it with our lives. Unfortunately, there are some people in this room think they can take it from us cause we were the little guys. I'm hoping that after this is all over, you will see how, by taking our honey, you not only take everything we have but everything we are. I wish you'd rest like that all the time. So nice. Only your first witness. So... Mr. Claus Vanderden of Honey Farms, the big company you have, I suppose so. I see you're also in Honey, Button and Honoran. Yes, they provide beekeepers for our farms. Beekeeper, I find them to be a very disturbing term. I don't imagine you employ any bee freers. Do you? No, I couldn't hear you. No, no, because you don't free bees. You keep bees. Not only that, it seems you thought a bear would be an appropriate image for a jar of honey. They're very lovable creatures. Yogi Bear. Fuzzy bear, build a bear. You may like this. Bears kill bees. How'd you like his head crashing through your living room, biting into your couch, spitting out your throat pillows? Okay, that's enough. Take him away. So, Mr. Sting, thank you for being here. Your name intrigues me. Where have I heard it before? I was with him and called the police. But you've never been a police officer, have you? No. I haven't. No. You haven't. And so there we have. Yet another example of bee culture casually stolen by a human for nothing more than a 
prance about stage name. Oh, please, have you ever been stung? Mr. Sting, because I'm feeling a little stung. Sting, or should I say, Mr. Gordon M. Sumner, that's not his real name. You idiots, Mr. Leota. First, belated congratulations on your MI1 for a guest spot on her in 2005. Thank you, thank you. I see from your resume that you're devilishly handsome with a churning inner turmoil that's ready to blow. I enjoy whatever I do. Is a crime. Not yet it isn't, but is this what it's come to for you? Exploiting, I mean. Helpless be so you don't have to rehearse your part and learn your lines. Sir, watch it. Benson, I could blow right now. This isn't a good fella. This is a bad fella. Why doesn't someone just step on this creep? And we can all go home. Order in this court. You're all thinking it. Order, order. I say, say it, Mr. Leota. Please sit down. I think it was awfully nice of that bear to pitch in like that. I think the jury's on our side. Are right. we doing everything right? Legally, I'm a florist. Right. Well, here's to a great team, too. A great team? Well, hello, Ken. Hello. I didn't think you were coming. No. I was just late. I tried to call, but the battery. I didn't want all this to go to waste. So I called Barry. Luckily, he was free. That was lucky. There's a little left. I could heat it up. Yet, yeah, heat it up. Sure. Whatever. So I hear you're quite a tennis player. I'm not much for the game myself. The ball's a little grabby. That's where I usually sit. Right. There, kid. Barry was looking at your resume, and he agreed with me that eating with chopsticks isn't really a special skill. You think I don't see what you're doing. I percent employment. But we do jobs like taking the crud out. That's just what I was thinking about doing, Ken. I let Barry bottle your razor for his fuzz. I hope that was all. Just about it with your little mind games. What's that? It only in vogue, Mamma Mia. That's a lot of pages, a lot of ads. Remember what Van said? Why is a life more valuable than mine? Funny. I just can't seem to recall that. I think something stinks in here. I love the smell of flowers. How do you lick the smell of flames? Not as much. Water bug. Not taking sides. Ken. I'm wearing a hapstick cat. This is pathetic. I've got issues. Well, well, well. A royal flush. You're bluffing. Eh. I surfs up. Dude. Put water. The bowl is not early, huh? Except for those dirty yellow rings. Kenneth. What are you doing? You know, I don't even like honey. I don't eat it. We need to talk. He's just a little bee. And he happens to be the nicest bee I've met in a long time. Long time. What? Are you talking about? Are there bugs in your life? No. But there are other things bugging me in life. And you're one of them. Fine. Talking bees. No yogurt tonight. My nerves are fried from riding on this emotional roller coaster. Goodbye, Ken. And for your information, I prefer sugar-free artificial sweeteners made by man. I'm sorry about all that. I know it's got an aftertaste. I like it. I always felt there was some kind of barrier between Ken and me. I couldn't overcome it. Oh, well, are you okay for the trial? I believe Mr. Montgomery's about out of ideas. We would like to call Mr. Barry Benson B. to the stand. Good idea. You can really see why he's considered one of the best lawyers. Yeah, Layton, you have gotta weave some magic with this jury. Or it's gonna be all over. Don't worry, the only thing I have to do to earn this jury around is to remind them of what they don't like about bees. You got the tweezers. Are you allergic? Only to losing. Son, only to losing, Mr. Benson B. I'll ask you what I think we'd all like to. No. What if exactly is our relationship to that woman? We're friends. Good friends? Yes. How good? Do you live together? Wait a minute. Are you a little bed? I've seen a bee documentary or two. From what I understand, doesn't your queen give birth to all the bee children? Yeah. But those aren't your real parents. Oh, Barry. Yes. They are. Hold me back. You're an illegitimate bee, aren't you? Benson. He's denouncing bees. No, you're all eight of your cousins. Objection. I'm going to concussion this guy. Adam. It's what he wants. I'm head. Oh, lordy. I am head. Order. Order. The venom. The venom is coursing through my veins. I have been felled by a winged beast of destruction. You see? You can treat them like equals. They're striped. Savages. Stinging's the only thing they know. It's their way. Adam. Stay with me. I. And feel my legs. What angel of mercy will come forward to suck the poison from my eating books? I will have order in this court. Order. Order. Please. The case of the honey bees versus the human race took a pointed turn against the bees yesterday when one of their legal teams stung laden to Montgomery. Hey, buddy, hey, is there much pain? Yeah, I, I blew the whole case. Didn't I? It doesn't matter. What matters is you're alive. You could have died. I'd be better off dead. Look at me. They got at it from the 
cafeteria downstairs, in a tuna sandwich. Look, there's a little, little celery still on it. What? Was it like to sting someone? I can explain it. It was all, all adrenaline and then, and then ecstasy. Alright, you think it was all a trap? Of course. I'm sorry, I flew us, right into this. What were we thinking? Look at us. We're just a couple of love bugs in this world. What lead will the humans do to us if they win? I don't know. I hear they put the roaches in motels. That doesn't sound so bad, Adam. They check in, but they don't check out. Why will you get a nurse to close the window? Why? The smoke. Bees don't smoke. Right. Bees don't smoke. Bees don't smoke. But some bees are smoking. That's it. That's our case. It is. It's not over. Get dressed. I've got to go somewhere. Get back to the court and stall. Stall any way you can. And assuming you didn't step correctly. You're ready for the tub, Mr. Flayman. Yes. Yes. Your Honor. Where's the rest of your team? Well, Your Honor. It's interesting. Bees are trained to fly haphazardly. And as a result, we don't make very good time. I actually heard a funny story about Your Honor. Haven't these ridiculous bugs taken up enough of this course valuable time? How much longer will we allow these absurd shenanigans to go on? They have presented no compelling evidence to support their charges against my clients, who run large admit businesses. I move for a complete dismissal of this entire case, Mr. Flayman. I'm afraid I'm going to have to consider Mr. Montgomery's motion, but you can't. We have a terrific case. Where is your proof? Where's the evidence? Show me the smoking gun. Hold it. Your Honor, you want a smoking gun? Here is your smoking gun. What is that? It's a bee smoker. What? This, this, harmless little contraption. This couldn't hurt a fly, let alone a bee. Look at what has happened to bees who have never been asked. Smoking or non, is this what nature intended for us? To be forcibly addicted to smoke machines and man-made wooden slat work camps. Living out our lives as any slaves to the white man. What are we gonna do? He's playing the species card, ladies and gentlemen. Please, free these bees. Free the 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 bees. Free the, bees. the court finds in favor of the bees. The necess- We won. I knew you could do it. High five. Sorry, I'm okay. You know what? This means all the honey will finally belong to the bees. Now we won't have to work so hard all the time. This is an unholy perversion of the balance of nature. Benson, you'll regret this, Barry. How much money is out there? All right, one at a time, Barry. Who are right? What do you mean? We've been living the bee way a long time. 27 million years. Congratulations on your victory. What will you demand as a settlement? First, we'll demand a complete shutdown of all bee work camps. Then we want back the honey that was ours to begin with. Every last drop, we demand an end to the glorification of the bear as anything, more than a filthy, smelly, bad breath stink machine. We're all aware of what they do in the woods. Wait for my signal. Take him out. He'll have nauseous for a few hours. Then, he'll be fine, though we will no longer tolerate the negative nicknames. But it's just a prance about stage name. Unnecessary inclusion of honey in bogus health products and la dee human tea time snack garnishments. On breathe. Bring it in. Boys, hold it. Right there. Good. Tap it, Mr. Buzzwell. We just passed through cups. And there's gallons. More coming. I think we need to shut down. Shut down. We've never shut down. Shut down. Honey production. Stop making honey. Turn your key. Sir. What do we do now? On on ball. We're shutting honey production. Mission abort. Aborting pollination. And nectar detail. Returning to base. Adam. You wouldn't believe how much honey was out there. Oh. Yeah. What's going on? Where is everybody? Are they out celebrating? They're home. They don't know what to do. Playing out. Sleeping in. I heard your uncle Earl was on his way to San Antonio with the cricket. At least we got our honey back. Sometimes I think. So if humans liked our honey, wouldn't. It's the greatest thing in the world. I was excited to be part of making it. This was my new desk. This was my new job. I wanted to do it really well. And now, now I can't. I don't understand why they're not happy. I thought their lives would be better. They are doing nothing. It's amazing. Honey really changes. People, you haven't have any idea what's going on. Do you? What did you want to show me? This, what happened here? It is not the half of it. Oh, no. Um, my, they were all wilting. Doesn't look very good, does it? No. And whose fault do you think that is? You know, I'm gonna guess bees. Bees, specifically. Me. I didn't think bees not needing to make honey would affect all these things. It's not just flowers, fruits, vegetables. They all need bees. That's our whole set test right there. Take away produce that affects the entire animal kingdom. And then, of course, 
the human species, so fierce, no more, pollination, it could all just go south here. Come, I know this is also partly my fault, how about a suicide pact, how do we do it, I'll stay, you step on me, that just kills you twice, right, right, listen, Barry, sorry, but I gotta get done, I had to open my mouth and talk, Vanessa, Vanessa, why are you leaving, where are you going, to the final tournament of Rose's Parade in Pasadena, they moved it to this weekend, because all the flowers are dying, it's the last chance I'll ever have to see it, Vanessa, I just will say I'm sorry, I never meant it to turn out like this, I know, me neither, tournament of roses, roses can't do sports, wait a minute, roses, 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 Vanessa, roses, berry, roses are flowers, yes, they are, flowers, bees, pollen, I know, that's, why this is the last parade, maybe not, will you ask him to slow down, will you slow, down, berry, okay, I made a huge mistake, this is a total disaster, all my fault, yes, it kind of is, I've ruined the planet, I wanted to help you with the flower shop, I've made it worse, actually, it's completely closed down, I thought maybe you were remodeling, but, I have another idea, and it's greater than my previous ideas combined, I don't want to hear it, alright, they have the roses, the roses have the pollen, I know every bee, plant and flower bud in this park, all we gotta do is get what they've got back here with, what we've got, bees, park, pollen, flowers, repollination, across the nation, tournament of roses, Pasadena, Olifornia, they've got nothing but flowers, floats and, cotton candy, security will be tight, I have an idea, Vanessa Bloom, FTD, official floral, business, it's real, sorry, mom, nice brooch, thank you, it was a gift, once inside, we, just pick the right float, how about the princess and the pea? I could be the princess, and you could be the pea. yes, I got it, where should I sit, what are you, I believe, I'm the pea. the pea. it goes under the mattresses, not in this fairy tale, sweetheart, I'm getting the marshal, you do that, this whole parade is a fiasco, let's, see what this baby will do, eh? what are you doing, then all you do is blend in with, traffic, without rousing suspicion, once, at the airport, there's no stopping us, stop, security, you and your insects pack your float, yes, has been in your, possession the entire time, would you remove your shoes, remove your stinger, it's, part of me, I know, just having some fun, enjoy your flight, then if we're lucky, we'll, have just enough pollen to do the job, only believe how lucky we are, we have just, enough pollen to do the job, I think this is gonna work, it's got to work, attention, passengers, this is Thane Scott, we have a bit of bad weather in New York, it looks like, we'll experience a couple hours delay, Barry, these are cut flowers with no water, they'll, never make it, I gotta get up there and talk to them, be careful, when I get help with, Sky Mall Magazine, I'd like to order the talking inflatable nose and ear hair trimmer, obtain, I'm in a real situation, what did you say, hell, nothing, B, don't freak out, my entire species, what are you doing, wait a minute, I'm an attorney, who's an, attorney, don't move, oh, Barry, good afternoon, passengers, this is your captain, would a, Miss Vanessa Bloom and 24B please report to the cockpit, and please hurry, what happened, here, there was a dust buster, a toupee, a life raft exploded, one's bald, one's in a boat, they are both unconscious, is it another big joke, no, no one's flying the plane, this is JFK control tower, flight 356, what's your status, this is Vanessa Bloom, I'm a, florist from New York, where's the pilot, he's unconscious, and so is the copilot, not, good, does anyone on board's a flight experience, as a matter of fact, there is, who's, that, Barry Benson, from the honey trial, oh, great, Vanessa, this is nothing more than per, a big metal bee, it's got giant wings, huge engines, I can't fly a plane, why not, isn't, John Travolta pilot, yes, how hard could it be, wait, Barry, we're headed into some, lightning, this is Bob Bumble, we have some late breaking news from JFK airport, where a, suspenseful scene is developing, Barry Benson, fresh from his legal victory, that's, Barry, is attempting to land a plane, littered with people, flowers and an incapacitated, Flight crew, flowers, we have a storm in the area, and to individuals at the controls, with an absolutely no flight experience, just a minute, there's a bee on the plane, I'm quite familiar with Mr. Benson, and his no account competitors, they've done enough damage, but isn't he your only hope, technically, a bee shouldn't be able to fly at all, their wings are this small, have we heard this a million times, the surface area of the wings and body mass make no sense, get this on the air, got it, 
Standby. Going live. The way we work may be a mystery to you. Making honey takes a lot of bees. Doing a lot of small jobs. But let me tell you about a small job. If you do it well, it makes a big difference. More than we realized. To us. To everyone. That's why I want to get bees back to working together. That's the bee way. We're not made of jello. We get Behind a fellow, black and yellow, below, left, right, down, hover, hover, forget, hover, this isn't so hard, beep beep, beep beep, Barry, what happened, wait, I think we were on autopilot the whole time, that may have been helping me, and now we're not, so, it turns out I cannot fly a plane, all of you, let's get behind this fellow, move it out, move out, our only chance is if I do whatever I do, you copy me with the wings of the plane, don't have to yell, I'm not yelling, we were in a lot of trouble, it's very hard to concentrate with that panicky tone in your voice. It's not a tone, I'm panicking, I can't do this, Vanessa. Pull yourself together, you have to snap out of it, you 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 snap out of it, hold it, why, come on, it's my turn, how is the plane flying, I don't know, hello, Benson, got any flowers, for a happy occasion. And in there, the pollen jocks, they do get behind a fellow, black and yellow, yellow. All right, let's drop this tin can on the blacktop, where I can't see anything. Only, no, nothing, it's all cloudy. Come on, you got to think B, Barry. Thinking B, thinking B, thinking B, thinking B, thinking B. Wait a minute, I think I'm feeling something. What? I don't know, it's strong, pulling me, like 27 million year old instinct, bringing the nose down, thinking B. Thinking B, thinking B. What in the world is on the tarmac? Get some lights on that. Thinking B, thinking B, thinking B. Vanessa, aim for the flower. Okay, out the engines. We're going in on B power. Ready, boys. Affirmative. Good, good, easy. Now, that's it. Land on that flower. Ready, full reverse. Spin it around. Not that flower. The other one. Which one? That flower. I'm aiming at the flower. That's a fat guy in a flowered shirt. We have the giant pulsating flower made of millions of bees. Pull forward, nose, down, tail up, rotate around it. This is insane. Barry, this is the only way I know how to fly. I, I cuckoo catch. Or is this plane flying in an insect-like pattern? Get your nose in there. Don't be afraid. Smell it. Full reverse. Just drop it. Be a part of it. Aim for the center. Now drop it in and drop it in. Woman, come on. Already, Barry. We did it. Yeah. Taught me how to fly. Yes. No high five. Right, Barry. It worked. Did you see the giant flower? What giant flower? Where? Of course I saw the flower. That was genius. Thank you. But we're not done yet. Listen. Everyone, this runway is covered with the last pollen from the last flowers available anywhere on Earth. That means this is our last chance. We're the only ones who make money. Pollinates flowers and dress like this. If we're gonna survive and live as a species, this is our moment. What do you say? Are we going to be bees? Or just Museum of Natural History key canes. Or bees, key cane, then follow me. Except the key cane, hold on. Barry, here, over in this. Yeah, I'm a pollen jock, and it's a perfect fit. All I gotta do are the sleeves. Oh, yeah, that's our Barry, Mom, the bees are back. If anybody needs to make a call, now's the time. I got a feeling we'll be working late tonight. Here's our change. Have a great afternoon. When I help, who's next? Would you like some honey? With that, it is be approved. Don't forget these. Milk. Cream. Cheese. It's all me. And I don't see a nickel. Sometimes I just feel like a piece of meat. I had no idea. Barry. I'm sorry. If you've got for a moment, would you excuse me? My mosquito. An associate will help you. Sorry I'm late. He's a lawyer too. I was already a blood sucking. Parasite. All I needed was a briefcase. Have a great afternoon. Barry. I just got this. Huge seal of the porter. And I can't get them anywhere. No problem. Vanny. Just leave it to me. You're a lifesaver. Barry, when I help who's next? All right. Scramble. Jocks, it's time to fly. Thank you. Barry, the bee is living my life. Let it go. Any, when lead will this nightmare end? Let it all go. Beautiful day to fly. Sure is. Between you and me. I was dying to get out of the office. You have got to start thinking bee. My friend. Thinking bee. Me. Hold it. Let's just stop for a second. Hold it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Everyone. When we stop here, I'm not making a major life decision during a production number. All right, take 10. Everybody, wrap it up. Guys, I have virtually no rehearsal for that. Be movie script according to all known laws of aviation. There is no way a bee should be 
elder fly. Its wings are too small to get its fat little body off the ground, the bee. Of course, flies anyway because bees don't care what humans think is impossible. Yellow.